Hello, I'm Kimon Francis. Attorney Valrenita Robertson has described the two-year sentence imposed on lawyer Isat Buchanan, who was found guilty of professional misconduct over comments he made about the country's chief prosecutor, Paula Llewellyn, as excessive. A disciplinary panel of the General Legal Council also fined Buchanan $520,000. Nita Robertson has objected to the sentence and says she's contemplating filing an appeal. The case against Jean Ann Panton, the accused in the multi billion dollar fraud investigation at investment firm Stocks and Securities Limited, SSL, has again been delayed. Due to an incomplete case file, the matter was postponed to May next year and Panton was further remanded. 27 farmers from Clarendon, Manchester and St. Elizabeth who were impacted by the recent heavy rains are set to receive weather insurance payouts. Minister of Agriculture Floyd Green told Parliament that the total payout amounts to $675,000. In sports, Homewood Technical High School's junior and senior teams are through to the ISA Schoolgirl Netball Finals with closer than usual wins over Glenmuir High and Denby High at the Manchester High School Netball Courts on Tuesday. In your currency trading today, one US dollar was being sold for $156.68, the British pound is sterling for $196.73, and the Canadian dollar for $115.76. In your weather forecast on Thursday morning, there will be isolated showers and windy conditions across northern parishes. In the afternoon, expect isolated showers mainly across northern and southeastern parishes and partly cloudy skies elsewhere. And that's it for the Gleaner Minute. Remember to follow us on X, formerly Twitter, Facebook and Instagram. And like, comment and share on YouTube. I'm Kimon Francis.